What was the first thing you noticed about me? Big ass eyes. <laughs> wow, wow. She's got big eyes. Big, sexy big eyes. It's the first thing I saw. I was like, wow, your eyes are actually quite big. I'm trying to think about what was the first thing I noticed about you. You fool. Wow. You were skinny back then. <laughs> a, oh yeah, yeah, I was so skinny. So was I. Yeah. So was I. Incompatible. Mm -hmm. Two sticks making a fire. Okay. Very yeah. cool. Mm. Okay. I don't know what the first thing I noticed about you was. Legit. My small eyes? No. My squeaky voice? No. My skinniness? No. <laughs> So I just I don't know, you were just a person. Was there wasn't there. anything that like stood out. Are you saying I'm an average guy? Maybe you're an average job. It is what it is. It is what it is. But that is so unfair though. Why? Like, I feel like there's probably something, I just can't make no, of it. But it's but, but it's not right because if I had to say that about you, you'd get offended as a lady. I wouldn't. I'd be like, oh I don't know. What my favorite color is, you don't know. What's what, my favorite what color? What attracted you to me? Your favorite color. Ooh. Isn't it like powder blue sky blue? <laughs> Isn't it like sky blue? Okay, you're close. You're close. I thought you were gonna get it wrong. What? You know, gonna say black? Maybe. Nah. We just wear black. You don't even know my favorite color. Um, <laughs> isn't your favorite color? Trash, burgundy. Trash alert. Burgundy. It is burgundy. Because that was his color for the wedding. Oh, I look so dapper. Mm hmm. You don't agree? No, you did. I said, mm hmm. Like. Faragord. Yeah, no. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> You're so weird. Uh huh. Um, how long have we been together? I have to answer you first. Um, we started dating in 2014. So that's what, that's six years. This year. And then we got married in December of 2019. So that's what, like six months, is it six months married? Not date. What's today's date? I don't know. It's June, right? It's the 13th of June. Mm. So tomorrow will be six months. Oh, hey, exclusive. Yeah. Maybe we'll drop our wedding video or snippets of it so you guys can see the yes. vibes. Um, yeah, so married for six months, dating six years. Does it count? Does it count? Do we count like dating? Like you see, like woman next year, and mm. do we say like okay, one year married, mm. but like seven years dating, or like <laughs> like are we still dating even though we married? Do you remember what I said to you when we started becoming an item? No. I said to you that the only title you have is you being my lifetime partner. Mm -hmm. So. It, for me, it does not necessarily matter if we are married or if we are dating. We count off as mm. as being part. So basically, you're just gonna say like how long we've been together. It's like, like, almost like six years. Okay. Um. What am I bad at? <sighs> I plead the fifth. <laughs> wow. No, man, like, why, why, why must I speak about your weaknesses? You can also speak right. about my strengths. Yeah, but the question is saying, what are you bad at? Yeah, and then you can ask, what am I good at? It's also another question. Uh, what are you bad at? Keeping time. Hey, man, Being on time. Yeah, you, you're outing yourself right now. <laughs> I mean, that's the biggest yeah, no, thing. Yeah, uh, Isn't that like number one on your list? That's like number three. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You want me to unleash? Okay. You are not a good listener. Hey. 
hectic. Yeah. Mm. Mm. You, you are not a good listener. Shots but... fired. I really don't. <laughs> <laughs> really don't. <laughs> but what I do love about you is that I think you know that. And you work very hard to making sure that other strengths that you might have are taken care of. So as much as you, you are not a good listener, when you hear me for the third time, <laughs> the you, third time. you make sure that whatever I've asked or trying to have a conversation with you about, you are very engaged, you give your all. So it takes some time to get you to listen, like, <laughs> like listen, listen. Yeah, not, no, true, because if you tell me something, hear me, I'm just going to be like, okay, because yeah. I heard you, yeah. like, I'm just like, okay, shut up. Okay. As in, like, the next time you will tell it to me again and then I'll be like, oh yeah. Actually, sometimes I can either be like, you didn't tell it because I have such a bad memory. Like, I could be like, what? You never said this? And then like, the I'm telling you this for the second time. All like, the time. All the time. Oh, okay. Then I'll be like, okay, okay, I ask you <laughs> I don't know why you find it funny. I really don't enjoy that. I didn't say it was funny. You've got a Colgate smile right now. Like, it's so annoying. It's and fine. I think I've just gotten to a point where I'm like, you know what? I, I take you as you are. You have to. <laughs> hey. Take me as I am. So, what am I bad at? I don't know. What are you bad at? Nothing. I'm flawless. You're impatient. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, you are. I'm the most patient no, person you ever meet. No, he's not. No, you don't. Why are you capping? I'm very patient. No, you're not. I waited six years, well, five years to make your mind. Oh, please. Through trials and tribulations, I stuck by you. Okay. I was there. And so are the days of our life. No, but okay, you know what? You are telling me, so I shouldn't be fighting what you're saying. So, okay, I'll take that out. Mm. I'm impatient. What makes you say that? You are impatient all the time. But what makes you say that? <laughs> like, you just want things like now. Yeah. Does that make me bad though? I didn't say it makes you bad, I just said you, yeah, and sometimes it's bad. Can you give me an example? I don't know, like... This is what you always do, you start, you, you start with certain points and then I ask for an example and you can't answer me. Because, like, there's so Lies. many... Lies! Lies! Because you're a liar. Um, I don't know. Cool. Like, basically, if you, like... I don't know, man. Like, let's say we're meeting up with people, mm -hmm. then, like, on the way, like, let's say, if, let's say we are really late, because I probably I made us late. I was about but to like, say, put it in context. We mm. probably already late, man. Nah. And then, <laughs> when we're meeting up with those other people, if those other people are also late, like, he gets so irritated, like, no, we're not waiting for them, we're leaving them. What? And I'm just like, bro, I don't we, know can what wait. About. we can wait. We can wait. Like a little about. bit. Like, obviously, I like, don't know I what just you're get impatient. About. I don't but know like, what you're talking about. I don't remember. Any of that happening. <sighs> All the time. Anyways, we can go to the next question. Um. <sighs> when did you meet my family? Oof. It's not an easy one because I make them sporadically okay, yeah, like, sure. at different times. So, who did you meet for my sister? You probably met my sisters first, day. Eh? Obviously, um, I met your, your siblings first, and then, but I wasn't even thinking of that. I was thinking more like of them, meeting like like your, and... your elders, yeah, because mm -hmm. I remember the first set of elders I met were your aunts in Oman. Mm -hmm. So I think I met them when I was like three years ago. I don't know what it was. I think we were two years in and your uncle was there. Mm -hmm. And I was parked outside. I used to drive a beetle back then. Yeah, used to be, he gives yeah. you flag about that beetle to this day. Even, even your dad gives me flag. <laughs> to this day. Yeah, so I used to drive a, a nice little bank, you know, made that, that sexy sound and then yeah used to drive around and then I met your family really nice people 
Yeah. I don't know when did I meet your family. You met my family once everything was done. So yeah, after the bola, that's when, much. But that's I when met she met my family. Your mom and dad. Yeah, I met your mom and dad like way before. Mm-hmm. I think when I was about three, three years in. I feel like I met your mom and dad before you met my sisters. No. Is that no. no. Yeah. Here we go with the bad memory. <laughs> no, you um, mm, How many questions have we answered? I don't know. I wanna do something fun. Okay, what do you wanna do? I don't know. Like <laughs> what? Let's read one more question and then we can do whatever. Mm, I'm just browsing through the questions to see. Nah, uh, bro, you shouldn't be browsing. You should have these questions in. What's my favorite restaurant? You have a favorite restaurant. Is that a trick question? <laughs> I don't know. What's your favorite restaurant? Do you have a favorite restaurant? Yes or no? Um. I can't recall. <laughs> I don't remember. Okay, top three. Top three. They don't count as restaurants. Say whatever. Whatever the food places they are. Rocco Mamas. That's your favorite. You said I must count them. But that's your favorite. So, does it make top three? I don't know. I don't think so. See, I'm already lost. Like. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're gonna say Rocco Mamas? Uh, I was gonna say Rocco Mamas, McDonald's, and Nando's. Yeah. Because you, you, you said restaurants, meaning sit down, places where we actually sit down and, and have food. Places. Yes, I'm saying that's why I mentioned them. And I didn't mention your chicken liquors and all that. Oh no, but I mean chicken liquor is like bottom tier, dude. Chicken liquor. Why is it bottom tier? I lost my phone. You always lose your phone. Hi, Auntie Debu. Uh, Hi. The youngest one. Anyways, I don't know. I don't know. Thumbnail. Okay. <laughs> you see what I have to deal with? Well, you know, I was raised with no sisters. I've got two brothers, one older and one younger. Mm-hmm. This is a very new experience for me. Like, I can't. I inherited two old babies. You inherited two old babies? <laughs> yeah. Your sisters are something else. I haven't gotten used to having sisters. And funny enough, I grew up with a lot of women in my family. Mm-hmm. Like when my parents were always around, or gone, mm-hmm. my aunts would be around. But this is a totally new experience. Mm-hmm.